My research focuses on developing technologies and devices for use in the millimetre wave and terahertz region of the electromagnetic spectrum. These high frequencies are predicted to be used for future wireless communication systems, car radar, as well as satellite communication and sensing systems. The millimetre wave and terahertz frequency bands are the part of the electromagnetic spectrum that lies between the radio and infrared parts. It's literally the meeting point between the electronic and photonic worlds. These are waves which are invisible to the human eye, but have a wavelength of several millimetres down to hundreds of microns. As part of this research, we're designing metamaterials which can guide and control millimetre wave and terahertz radiation. So metamaterials are materials which are not found in nature, but are materials which we've engineered from the ground up to have precise optical and electromagnetic properties. These materials allow us to control terahertz and millimetre waves in unprecedented ways. We're starting to see the adoption of millimetre waves for mobile wireless communication, automotive radar and concealed weapon detection at airports. But this is just the beginning. And in the future, we're going to see a much wider use of this range of frequencies for a whole range of exciting applications. With the standards for 6G communications currently under development, the millimetre wave and terahertz frequency ranges are predicted to play a significant role in increasing the speed of mobile wireless communications. Additionally, millimetre wave and terahertz frequencies will be used for security and biomedical imaging applications. At Imperial College London, we have clean room facilities for creating micro and nano devices, as well as the tools we need to characterise our devices up to hundreds of gigahertz.